Thanks for tuning in. My name's Samantha. I'm from Top Dog Tips. And today I wanted to make a video about some home remedies for cat urinary tract infections. Urinary tract infections are something commonly seen in cats. They're not typically something to get very worried about. However, if left untreated, they can do some long-term damage to your cat's urinary tract. So it is something that you wanna take care of as soon as you realize that there is a problem. And in just a second, I'll talk more about the symptoms and how you can tell that your cat has a urinary tract infection. The urinary tract infection can attack any part of your cat's urinary tract. So it can affect the bladder, the kidneys, the urethra, which is where the urine comes out of the body. And there are two different types of UTIs. Bacterial UTIs are caused when bacteria enters the urinary tract. Those are the most common kind. Um, if you think about it, if you have a cat that uses the litter box, they squat down, um, and that area of their body is very close to a lot of bacteria when they're outside, on the ground, on the floor in your home. That area of their body is close to places where bacteria live. So that's the most common kind. The home remedies that I'm discussing today will work best on bacterial infections. While they are the most common by far, it is impossible to tell what caused your cat's urinary tract infection without seeking veterinary care. So if you're worried about your cat, um, if you think that the symptoms are severe, if you think that there's something more going on, like if your cat has frequent UTIs, you really need to seek the advice of your veterinarian immediately. Speaking of that, if your cat has frequent UTI issues, there is most likely some sort of underlying cause. And without treating that underlying cause, you're never gonna get rid of the urinary tract infections and it could do some long-term health damage down the road. So if your cat has frequent urinary tract infections, you do wanna make an appointment to be seen by your veterinarian as soon as possible. Some of the conditions that can cause urinary tract infections are um, bladder crystals or stones, kidney disease, diabetes, thyroid disease. So there's some really heavy hitters that can cause UTIs and you may not notice anything but frequent urinary tract infections. So even though you think there might not be anything wrong, there definitely could be uh, my advice, absolutely seek attention from your vet as soon as possible. No matter what type of urinary tract infection your cat has or what's causing it, the symptoms are pretty typical. So the things you should be looking for are frequent urination, um, especially if your cat is urinating frequently and only small amounts are coming out, pain during urination, straining during urination, any kind of blood or cloudiness, discoloration in the urine, um, and of course, uh, licking of the genital areas frequently, more frequently than normal. If you notice that they're licking and that seems to be causing pain, um, it's a really good sign that your cat has a urinary tract infection. If you're seeing any of these symptoms and they seem to be mild, you could definitely try these home remedies. If you're seeing more severe symptoms, as I mentioned, it could be that your cat's had a UTI for a while and you just never noticed. It could be that there's something else going on. So I would definitely recommend um, discussing that with your vet, at least calling for a consultation and see what they say. My first home remedy for urinary tract infection, and you hear this actually used in humans as well, is cranberry. Cranberries are commonly recommended as home remedies for UTIs for cats, dogs, humans, um, you name it. And that's because they contain a substance that prevents bacteria from sticking to the walls of the urinary tract. So if it can't stick, it's flushed away naturally when the body eliminates the urine. I wouldn't recommend giving your cat cranberry juice because it does contain a lot of sugar, but you can buy cranberry supplements that are easily added to your dog's diet. Usually they come in capsule form and you can just break the capsules and sprinkle that supplement over your pet's food. Um, it does have a, an odor that's different for your cat. So if your cat is picky and doesn't seem to want to eat it with the supplement on it, try mixing the cranberry supplement in with some wet food or some homemade cat food to entice your pet. I do have a quick cheap recipe for homemade cat food that I've shared. So you can check that out um, if you're interested in that. My second home remedy is marshmallow root. Uh, similar to cranberry supplement, marshmallow root is another supplement that can be given for UTIs. It offers natural anti-inflammatory properties that work especially well on mucous membranes like the ones in your cat's urinary tract. However, if your cat's on any other medications for anything, make sure to check with your veterinarian because marshmallow root could actually inhibit the absorption of certain medications. Um, you can find marshmallow root at any natural food store or natural living center. Um, also, as some pharmacies carry it as well in the supplement aisle. Third, uh, apple cider vinegar. This is one of my go-to home remedies for a number of things with my dogs and cats, but one thing that it's good for is to help treat urinary tract infections. 
It will naturally lower the pH of your cat's urine. Uh, you can mix about a half a teaspoon of apple cider vinegar with your cat's food each day. Again, the same thing with the cranberry. It does have a strong odor, so if your cat seems to not want to have their food with the apple cider vinegar on it, mix it in with some wet food or some homemade food to make it a little bit more enticing. My fourth home remedy is bone broth. One of the absolute best things you can do for a urinary tract infection, no matter which type of animal it is in, is proper hydration. The more water you're taking in, the more you're eliminating and it's flushing out that uh, urinary tract. So hydration is key, especially if your cat isn't drinking enough water. Bone broth is really great um, because it will entice them to drink more and it's got a really high water content. So again, I've made a video guide on how to make your own homemade bone broth, but you can also purchase some most grocery stores have it um, and again you can find it in natural stores as well um, and that again will just help to flush out the urinary tract and clean out any buildup of bacteria another um, great thing about bone broth is that it has natural anti-inflammatory properties so it'll help to soothe that urinary tract flush out all the bacteria and get things back to normal those are my four home remedies for a cat urinary tract infection. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. You can also click the little bell down bottom and that will uh, get you the notifications of new content that we post all the time. There's information on home remedies, homemade food and treats, lots of tips and tricks for training pets and uh, caring for them, grooming them. So be sure to check that out. And um, again, thanks a lot for tuning in guys. Feel free to email us if you have any other questions.